A statement win by the Leafs last night, the Raptors take on the T-Wolves and the Canadian men's soccer team will wrap up their World Cup qualifying run tonight in Panama with plenty still to play for. I'm Sarah and this is Toronto Today. Even though the Toronto Maple Leafs lost their starter, Peter Morazic, to an injury just a few minutes into this one and lost two defensemen along the way, they still found a way to pummel the Bruins 6-4 last night in their own stadium. Austin Matthews, of course, scored in the Leafs' win, his league-leading 49th goal of the season. The Maple Leafs superstar now has 42 goals in his last 44 games simply ridiculous. Over the last few weeks, Toronto has now gotten wins over the Carolina Hurricanes, the Florida Panthers, and now the Boston Bruins, sending a message to the rest of the league that they're here to compete with the best in the East. To the hard court now, as the Raptors look to stay hot against the visiting T-Wolves tonight at Scotiabank Arena. Toronto has won nine of their last 11 games, but the Timberwolves aren't slouches like they used to be and have plenty to play for down the stretch here. Carl Anthony Towns will be Toronto's main focus on defense tonight, but they'll also have to be wary of Anthony Edwards and D'Angelo Russell, two players that could catch fire for the T-Wolves. The Raptors will enter as three-point favorites, and with just over two weeks left, a win tonight could see them move into sole possession of fifth in the Eastern Conference, so there's plenty to play for. Speaking of plenty to play for, after booking their ticket to Qatar on Sunday at BMO Field, the Canadian men's national team will try to finish World Cup qualifying on a high note against Panama this evening. A victory tonight will not only see them qualify at the top of their region, it'll put them into pod three of Friday's World Cup draw, meaning that their group in Qatar will be slightly weaker. So in other words, there's still a lot at stake tonight down in Panama and Canada will be going for the win. And you can get that at plus 110. And with that, we're all caught up on sports in the six. Be sure to follow us on all of our socials and check out parlay.tv for our latest betting insights and trends on tonight's games.